Hi, guys. True, <laughs> get your ass in the car. Welcome to the Mighty Jade Empire podcast. <laughs> right Hi, now, Desi. you got me, Just, Justin Love, Black Dragon 79, the one and only First Lady of Jade, Nerdish Girl, my boy Shin Marvel. We're waiting for Anthony. We're waiting for Franco. But we are here. We are live. You have all fucking week to game. You know Sundays from like 3 to 6 are podcast days. Get your ass in here. <laughs> you can game and talk at the same time. You do it all the fucking time. It ain't like you're going to turn your camera on anyway, true. Nice. Hell, I'm about to uh, stream some Streets of Rage. I've decided I want that game, by the way. You so do. It's pretty hot. Let me just pull out PS4 money out my ass, okay? Well, <laughs> you're a big time streamer now. You're making thousands per stream. Are you fucking serious? I'm a big time streamer. Do you know how hard I struggle to make my streamer girl check every month? She probably lived in Jersey probably, if she was a big time streamer. You probably got like, what, 10 YouTube subscribers now, girl? You balling. You in I there. I don't even have a YouTube subscriber. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and you're waiting to run an old lady because who's someone loud as fuck? Turn him down. Yeah, I need to turn Eugene down because he is loud as fuck. Who? You. you. How am I loud? Well, you're coming out of her screen loud. I already, I already lowered your volume. Me. No, it's definitely not you, Mikey. You're quiet as fuck. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I'm up. Eugene is loud and no discretion. So yeah. <laughs> That's just Eugene. So, yeah, oh, look who's about. joined the party. Who that be? Oh, True decided to come in. Okay. Good. I can you cover your, your little thing with my chat because you don't turn your mic on anyway. True. True. You got to um, do a face reveal. You got coffee? Let's go. I have added all those who gave me their social media info, info in my chat. So if you want to get a hold of somebody, let me know and I'll let you know which commands will go to that person. Listen, I'm just gonna put my phone number in there. Like better not. Mom. You better be, drop your digits, and I'm not gonna laugh when you get trolled all day. Okay. Mike, oh, something is up with your feed. You're going in and out, dude. Hey, I'm gonna drop my real number. Come on, dude. I'm the one dude not in here. Or oh, forgot. My feed should I be have... good. No, you, no you, you're going in and out. You're Mikey. going in and out, and it's lagging behind. Like you'll talk, and you we won't we'll hear you, but then we won't you won't move till like after you said what you this said. Is what, this is Mikey. Do this for me, okay? It's because you were muted for so long. Discord gets dumb sometimes, right? I need you to shut your Discord completely and then come back into the call. All right. Yes. That is what it, it's just Discord. Discord is kind of dumb. Oh, I see. Take the mic out of your mouth. It's nowhere near his mouth. It's on the thing in front of him. <laughs> so I guess tomorrow I'm going to make a trip to Best Buy and get like a regular wired mic. You need a regular headset to do these kind of things just because it makes it easier. And then I'd Justin... highly suggest everybody gets a regular headset. Justin's got his own little setup. He knows he's got all that extra shit to make it work. But if you don't have all <laughs> well, that yeah, extra you need... shit to make it work. Yeah, you need one of two things, Gene. Either a new headset or audio interface to plug into your computer. Because the audio interface will pretty much solve all of that shit. A what now? An audio interface. It's like a completely separate okay. box that you connect to your computer specifically for audio. Basically, oh, okay. that's what my controller does. My controller acts as an audio interface. There you go. How much will nothing uh, you send me a link to one? I'll look it up on Amazon, or you could. Could I was just gonna go to Helm Repo. I mean, damn. I mean, best why I just get a uh, auxiliary mic, like a mic, like a headset, like this. Just mm, plug in. No, you can do that, and it'll probably be cheaper. Yeah, but a nice little boom mic, so I look like a trucker. I need to get an upgrade of an actual like mic that's not like this, because What's I, wrong with that, I need to be a real gamer girl with better audio and shit like that. I need my little mic, my mic stand. I gotta get a better webcam. I gotta get another freaking. Cam, you keep me real. You don't need all the extra shit. <laughs> I need a better webcam and I need another monitor. Okay. Because oh, yeah. then I don't have to do this little ghetto thing where I have to put half of the things he said. 
Um, well, that's because you're in like rural Finland, big boss. And it's just like we didn't know that your army used tractors, but we found that out last night. <laughs> All right, talk, Mikey. Welcome back, Mike. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, Still having lag better. issues. No, you're better. Yeah, you're better. Okay. So, real quick, I feel like this podcast is going to be mostly about video games. I was talking to some of the fellas. I got some opinions about stuff. Eugene brought up a good one. Uh, apparently, The Last of Us got pushed back to, what, June 19th? Yeah. And no uh, Now, granted, I don't play Last of Us, but I've only heard nothing but good things about it. Eugene, give us the skinny on what's going on with the new Last of Us. Well, the entire game, the game is entirely was um, leaked. Story and everything. Ending, it was just leaked. Just like, fuck it, here it is. Now, so, just for anyone watching, you're not going to give away any of that information, right? I didn't watch no. it. Okay, cool. So there's two stories. Don't know which one is confirmable, but one side says the developers who are developing the game, um, I guess one of the dudes on his way out the door, the game ready to leave, and um, now you all didn't want to pay him until the game was released. Oh, wow. So I, so I guess he got pissed and said, fuck it, leaked everything. And then other sources are saying hackers did it. Or it could have been both. Who knows? Like, I posted an article in the, uh, in the chat earlier. I posted it on Reddit, so there you go. I don't know. I think I'd be that bitter person. If, if that was getting put out the door, I'm leaking everything. I'm telling yeah, the too. story, I'm telling the beginning, I'm telling the ending, I'm telling you how you get this, how you get that, I'm telling you all the secret entrances. <laughs> Guess what? Y'all want to fire me? Kiss my ass. I'm telling everything. Fuck this game. <laughs> <laughs> now, see, if you were smart, you'd sell it. You'd be like, hey, I'm the one that made the game, and they ain't going to pay me, so you want the ending, and you want to know how it happens? Send $5 to my PayPal right now, and I got you. Real, yep. $5 adds up real quick when there's millions of people that want to play this game. Word up. Facts. So, in the meantime, I'm streaming some of Streets of Rage 4 with my feet up. Like, oh, yeah. Don't put them crusty toes in Cam. You can't show feet on Twitch. You can't? No. <laughs> like, no, you seriously? Can't. You can't? No, I can't show my feet on Twitch because they're too fetishized. Wow. Not then, not though. So, is that what I got to do, Big Boss, to keep you focused on stream? Just say tractor every once in a while? I, I, don't, I don't think men feet or, or would be a problem as more the women. Well, no, because women have and feet fetishes too. Yeah, women, they, they're women. Yeah. I know this is really hard to believe, and I'm not saying this is my thing because you, it's not. There are girls that actually like the most fucked up feet you could think of. They want that big foot, big claw, toenail. Eight inches of crusties. <laughs> yeah. 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 Hey, man, hey, man. Don't be talking about the boys out there with the eagle talons. They need us, too. That's your feet true? <laughs> oh, no. 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 I sent you a YouTube, not a YouTube, a uh, um, Amazon link about one of the mics that I looked at. Or at least it's the mic I'm using. <gasps> Gene, turn your, Gene, turn your PlayStation down, dude. I know, I know, I'm doing it now. Shit. Someone's mic is barking. That would be Eugene. He's always barking. Oh, he always barking. He did his, he did his okay, yeah, I'll tell you exactly why your mic is barking. You are using a Sony Bluetooth headset with an array okay. microphone. That microphone is built to pick up all of the surrounding audio because it's not a boom mic. A boom mic. Or something like this, which is right in front of my face, is picking up my audio. Kim's microphone is picking up her audio. Your microphone is a little hole on the side of your headset. And it's picking up, it's picking up everything. everything. Hold on. Don't sw- don't me... change nothing. No, I'll, go, I'll go switch my snowball and see if that, will that make anything better. No. It's not going to change nothing. Just turn your TV down. Just turn your TV down. It's not on. Then you're fine. Just remember, any noise you make in your room, right where you are right now, is going to be amplified like crazy. We're going to hear you cough, fart, sneeze, turn on the TV, you know, scratch your nut, all of that. We're yes. going to hear it. Well, hell, I got a couple more right now, so my bad. Now, I'm fucking with y'all. <laughs> oh, look, Anthony's here. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Anthony L. Lewis. 
The all-purpose Listen, champion is Gabby. What's up, brother? Gabby wants to know if we're going to hear your BBW porn, Eugene. I don't have BBW porn. Okay. I watch Christian porn. Christian Praise porn? Lord. No, that's too much missionary. You and Anthony is silent. In your life. Hey, hey listen, is this on live on your channel? Yeah, we are yeah, currently live, live on, on and Twitch. And I'm live too. Okay, both of you guys. Brother Starks. What's up, Magic Mike? Oh, my bad, Doc Marvel. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yes, you're very welcome. Magic very well. Mike. You about to have somebody turn it on Pony in my stream if you say Magic Mike. <laughs> <laughs> So can we get drunk on stream or no? Or is that getting yes. I get drunk every weekend on stream. Are you kidding me? I was drunk as fuck last night. Oh, fuck yeah, I'm, look at this. This is a big ass bottle of uh, tequila. No, I have one. That's I look like lemonade. I had these no. drinks, but I have a pink one that has llamas on it, and I fill it this much with vodka and then this much with cranberry juice, well, and I drink two of them. How about this next Sunday, right? Just you get a big ass case of Heineken. I get my preferred beer. Please, get a bitch, I'm lightweight as hell. I have two hot and I'm done for the night. Why I gotta get a wine cooler? Cause you's a bitch. Damn. Damn, that hurts. Damn. I'm telling you, I Damn. want Don't, hold up. Don't. a Saturday night podcast with the boys of the Jade Empire and me drunk. Except for Anthony, because we know he's I was going to say, except for Anthony. <laughs> I'll, I'll, be the one that, I'll be the one to keep y'all, you know, not getting too crazy. I'll be like, whoa, whoa. And I just want us to just sit here and bullshit like we used to when we would go to like the diner after the club and shit. Oh man, yeah, that was, that was some good. I time. just want us to sit there and or talk about the dumbest things we used to do together that we could say on Twitch without getting in trouble. Oh, we, we did a lot of dumb shit. We, we can talk about that we, shit we right now. We in trouble talking about a lot of the dumb shit we did. We've done a lot of dumb shit. Look, like, yes, but... indeed. <laughs> I remember the time these two cowards. Hi, drone. And Anthony left me hanging at Catman. Dude. Cowards, my ass. Oh, How about we were the smart ones and you, you were the dumbass? I... Listen, Look, hold on, on. Who's, um, can I say something? Uh, down there. He, is that that's true? true. That's true. It's true. Okay. He only does this because he likes this story told about himself. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm so hot that y'all just straight left me hanging. I was uh, just Dude, story. Um, story. Story. we tell had no story. choice. The cops told us to bounce. That's Hold what up. I, I, here's what I don't like. I don't like you always leave out my part. Now, you could say Justin left you, right? You could say Franco left you. You could say Kim left you. You could say Mike left you. But I, I walked no up choice. to the... Hold up. I walked up to the cops, and my I, man stiff on me like we was playing football. He was like, mind your business. I was and like, I never leave that part out. That's an integral part of the story. I always tell that part when I tell the story. He always leave that, it out. That was funny, though. Yeah. I, I got I'm hit sorry, harder than you got slammed against the car. Hell yeah. <laughs> that ain't fair. And let's be honest, you probably wouldn't have got slammed against the car so hard if you weren't Eugene with no discretion. I'm just saying. Oh, mm -hmm. you, know, you want to know, you know something funny? Remember the, the, the officer like that just appeared off thin air that that black dude I actually ran into him not that long ago. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah, I don't remember what nobody looked like from that night. He looked old as hell though, but still. For somebody that don't drink no. smoke, you don't remember nobody when you go to the club. For real. No, I no, remember listen, a lot I'm, of I'm things a... from the club. Like I remember that one Halloween where they were doing the, the chicks costume contest. And you know the chicks that. just come there with like as little as they can know. And he had the two bitches. One was dressed in all red lingerie and was the devil. And one was dressed in all white and had little wings and was an angel. And the angel was on stage doing her little thing and the devil hated it and hey. yoinked that bitch right off the stage by her hair. And Here's then they started fighting. With that story. Justin, oh talk God, to you about here we day. go. And the fact that she just brought her up, I'm mad at you. Why now, are you mad at me? Hold on, before he even say. says anything, you know what? If no. I literally changed his future that night because if because if he had hung out with her, we may not even be sitting here right now. I know, but we saved him and he's where he needs to be now because of that, okay? Hey, Justin, man. I'm just saying and I ah. But see you well. can't say nothing because I'm right. <laughs> no, you are right, but who knows where I would have been at? It's Franco! Franco! Only temporary. I was trying to watch it while I was driving. Ladies, <laughs> do not kill hey, yourself. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm in the parking God. lot right now. <laughs> Get oh, what? Ladies and gentlemen, Minnie Mac is out. in the building. 
She so I, I, I picked up on your talking about uh, talking about Eugene's uh, adventures with the police. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, all I'm gonna say is. Eugene, you the prototype for all the people in Atlanta that's that ran out there to buy the Jordans. <laughs> oh, man. damn! Dude, I wear I wear sneakers from from Payless at Walmart. Damn! No, 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 no. Understand what I'm saying? What you did with those cops is literally the prototype of what those people are doing for those Jordans. Oh, they put not, some big in there. Oh my god! Making, oh, what's going on with the Jordans right now? Not making good life decisions. Apparently they, they basically bum rush like the store in what is Atlanta it a Foot Locker? Because my this is my thing. You walk in, you're inebriated. You're in a crowd with other people of color. There's multiple different branches of the law enforcement around you. Trenton, state troopers, probably the fucking transit police if they were around at the time. <laughs> and you thought it was a good idea to go fuck the police, right? <laughs> And then, you also thought, and then you also thought that everybody else was wrong for walking away. Look, Bro, I was like, I would have walked away. At <laughs> least uh, it would have been somebody there to get your ass out of jail afterwards. Yeah, exactly. As opposed to all y'all sitting your ass in jail because you had to say, "Fuck the police." And not for nothing, Eugene. When being gangster goes wrong. Yep. <laughs> yep. Oh yeah, that that shit went left. And I already think and was found wanting. And I already think I know where Anthony was going to go because, like he said, not for nothing, we was all sitting there in the parking garage when you was done. I know we didn't leave. Yep. leave. We, we could have went to the diner. <laughs> hey, hey, hold up! What was we doing in the parking lot? Parking, parking lot. lot. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Eugene. Oh, it's, all, it's all good though. We make dumb ass mistakes, we learn from it, and we move on. Yeah. And that's what those people in Atlanta were doing. Talking about some. Oh, and that, the and get, I'm gonna go stand in line and catch COVID nineteen so I can buy this same pair of Jordans that have been released twelve times. Yo. Nope. What's up, Dave? My boy Dave just dropped in on the uh, the stream, guys. Is that a great one? Hi. Yeah. What up? He actually it was funny. He was just watching my last stream, and then uh, he jumped in this one. That's hey. what it is. He actually was in my Great. wedding. Welcome to the channel. Welcome, welcome. Uh, I'm I'm you, we, we could like talk for hours just about the dumb stories we have. New Egypt. Hmm? New Egypt. And hey, we don't speak about that, Eugene. This is, th listen, listen, just because we almost all got arrested because we were in New Egypt and I was oh, one, Jesus. one little Jesus. white girl with a car full of black dudes and they're like, you okay, ma'am? I'm fine. <laughs> I'm sorry, Someone's man. having a super good boob day. Why? Thanks for noticing, Jazzy. I try well, to have good boob days when I'm on here. So, Kim, who is that girl in Hamilton, yo, that starts freaking out that night we all try to leave? In Hamilton? Yeah. Some some girl you and Amy knew. We was all at me, Justin, and we was all one night, right? We, she was real. Is it the skinny girl? girl? The real skinny girl? I don't know if she is a white girl with big ass titties. She's just starting to come back to me. <laughs> I'm trying okay. to we we tried to leave. Here's what's crazy. We, hold on, Gene. Here's what's crazy. You said something that was important because we have we have different sections with Kim. We have the Kim and Nikki and the Kim and Amy. <laughs> there was Kim and Kim by herself too, you know. Well, we know, but Kim was I just apparently being... was like the bitch bringer. Like yeah, I bring yeah. the bitches for the guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's oh, what I man. did. Never had to bring them for me. I got my own. <laughs> I know you borrowed a couple. Yeah, I was about to say. Hold on, uh, we said a name already <laughs> that you had something to do with. So without Kim, <laughs> like, no. Uh, but, but see, here, here, here's was... the difference. Here's the difference. I met her and Kim. Right. Separate from meeting them through y'all. I laid my mat game down and scored off the strength of me. I was thinking, no, no. I, I remember somebody's eclipse in the Katmandu parking lot with some foggy windows, is all I'm going to say. I'm just saying, if it wasn't for Kim, you, you try to exclude Kim, but still Kim. I, Kim was I, didn't, 
I didn't try to exclude Kim. I literally, I met Kim and Amy at Catman Do right. and didn't know they knew you. Right. Until like a couple weeks later, when I was like, yeah, Ed, that's my best friend. Yeah, yeah but I'm just saying, originally you was like, I didn't need Kim. No, I'm just saying, Kim no. was the Kim bringer. Was part. Kim was the bringer of bitches. I'm telling yeah. you. Yeah, gotta give her credit. I, 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 I came into contact with Kim and Amy together. You yes, but saying? see, so Amy she, was she not going to come to Catman and do it, so I brought her. No, listen to, listen to what Kim just said. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Listen, Amy listen to what Kim just said. Amy would have been at Do if it wasn't for me. Right. And I wouldn't have met either one of y'all if I didn't go to Catman Do. See? Yes. Fuck. Mm. So either way you look at it, on the strength of, hold on, let me pull this back a little bit so you can see my RVD. <laughs> All <laughs> on me. <laughs> <laughs> you got your salad, your own. I'm hungry now. I dragged you out the club. I get some credit for that. Hey, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. Who remembers the night that Mikey took Big Nig the Gorilla from my car and took it to the top of the parking garage and was dropping it on cars as they drove out of the parking garage? <laughs> I'm not gonna put myself involved in that. I don't remember that. That's it. You supposed when you say stuff like that, Kim, you're supposed to say allegedly. No, no, the no, the time, whatever, it's out of like it's been too far to prosecute. We're fine. We can talk about it. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Hey, hey, did you did y'all see what uh the great one said in the in the comments? No. <laughs> no, I didn't see no comments. He said he said as soon as I as soon as he said big A titties, he said, I'm starting to remember. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really trying to remember who had the big ass titties. I did. Oh, it's man. all coming back to me now. To me now. <laughs> like, I've always been the one with the bigger titties in the group because Amy had big titties, but they weren't that big. Yeah. Nah, Amy had had no they they kind of was. Hey, hey, listen. Amy had some bazongas. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah, they were kind of big. But you know what I'm going to say? She had the classic big titty girl body. Big titty, no booty. Yeah, no ass. Absolutely. Yeah, she had none. Yeah. Her ratio was not equivalent to the size. You, Kim, at least you got some equivalent ratio to it. Yeah, right. so I got a big titty and ass. Thank you. Uh, Sam was a twig, so it wasn't Sammy. It wasn't Nikki, because she really didn't go to Catman and do that much. Right, she didn't, yeah. Who, who remembers the girl that used to go to Catman and do? I don't know if she was like, all of our friends, and we all just kind of know from Cam and do, but she always would come with this fucking makeup that would glow in the fucking dark, and she would get pissed off because she looked like a fucking ghost. <laughs> do y'all remember seeing that chicken cat man do? Yeah, okay, she, 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 put about. On two white, she put literally like white powder on her fucking face and then yeah. go underneath the black lights, and she looked like a dang ghost. She would look crazy as fuck. <laughs> I don't remember her. Listen, oh, Justin, Justin was always the dude that connected with all the chicks, so I'm going to say Justin knew her. <laughs> <laughs> Justin's the one that started talking online to me at Catman, dude. Yeah, the I'm telling you, me. I could, listen, oh, just no. listen, Justin started talking to you first. I was just saying, hey, my daughter, what would you say, Mike? All them girls came to see Justin Dan. That's how they oh, yeah. get it. He started doing that dance where he bounced back Sam, and forth and in the Sam middle of the Sam circle and shit. He was doing the, he was doing the big boy bop. Yeah, I plead. I'm the fucking DJ around busting knee cap right now. You know, you gotta go to one of Justin's DJ streams for that. I'm an old ass man right now. And even Ned trust me, oh my god. Or, so, or when Justin and Anthony would break down and hit the crybaby in the middle of the floor, cat man dude. They'd all start looking for that too. That was just Anthony trying to get his nut off on the floor. Fucking <laughs> 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 pervert. <laughs> oh, shit. Wow. Welcome back, Drew. Uh, but uh, I'm going to have to jump out momentarily. I might make it back on before y'all are done. Oh, but we know. discuss things that some people around may not be comfortable hearing. <laughs> yeah. Okay, hey, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
don't know what he just said because Mike was talking at the same time you was talking. Yeah, exactly. So I, I didn't. I was hear saying what something about Mike's forehead circumference to his body ratio. <laughs> Yo, Mike. You know, Mike. I feel like this is a Mike do a stream bomb. Whenever somebody start talking, Mike uh, start talking exactly when you start talking. Just so you can like, it's like, like, no, 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 no. <laughs> it's like when we play Destiny. You ask for directions, and Mike always give the opposite direction. Like well, we're in the next room right, already. Right. I am not that bad. Because Mike always that. running off somewhere. Hell yeah. But I'm about to start driving again, y'all. All right, right brother. Be, uh, be careful, brother. Hell yeah. You look up, yeah, Mike, in the next I'm room already. I was not that bad in Destiny. Getting killed. You was that bad you in that Destiny. You that bad in life. Are you kidding me? We would look up and we tell you to stay here and your ass go over there some damn where. No, my bad. I, um... All right, right. It's not true. It's <laughs> not true. Mike. So, I'm currently on Best Buy's website looking for a microphone for his computer. Mikey, don't, because we know the truth. So did y'all touch any of the topics while, when I was, uh, wasn't was on here? Uh, did yeah, Eugene did Last talk about the Last of Us stream. He didn't, he did he, he as well didn't watch any of the, um, leagues. So it was okay, safe, cool. it was safe. But, uh, oh, cool, cool. as they think happened with the game, I don't think I'm going to get it now. Well, from what I've heard, seen, oh, damn it. read... I'm going to get some chocolate. Let me know when to see. A lot of what people are complaining about is some of the details from the previous games they enjoyed are being nixed, and they're shoehorning a lot of go woke issues into it. Yep. And a lot of people are like the point of my entertainment medium is to entertain me, not to preach. And that, that's where a lot of people are having issues and complaining. Uh, well, I haven't played the first one, so I don't care. I haven't either. I haven't played it at all. So I'm not looking forward to this one. I don't. I don't, I don't. Like, for me, Last of Us is one of those games where I would love to sit there and watch someone else play it for the story. But I'm not playing that shit myself. I, I was going to say, you could totally play it yourself because PlayStation gave it away for free, like, what, two months ago? Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm only looking for two games. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, still talking Last of Us? Not really. They didn't say anything that, that, that Yeah, he that, like, didn't. See, he didn't say any speaking nobody... spoilers. <sighs> no spoilers. No spoilers. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I've been terrified to click on any of them links that say the leaks and all that because I've seen. Don't do it because it will ruin your day. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen bro. some people said they was annoyed by it and stuff. I was like, I don't even want to know. That's only if you're planning on getting it though. Gotcha. Plus, you oh, might end up seeing those videos and articles next to people being upset about Blunt, about the Guardian game. So, pick your poison. The Guardian games? Yeah, you're talking yeah. about the uh, Destiny thing. Oh, that shit they, is they, so ass, yo. No, people are upset calling it rigged and yada, yada, yada. Oh, what, as far as what class is winning? Yeah, because since day one, hunters ain't been able to get their flag up. They've been chilling in third. Whereas Titans hit first and Warlocks is is just sitting in second regardless. It's funny that people are mad about a video game competition in a video game. <laughs> like, yeah. Craig, it's like, wait, wait, what? And what part you of know a video game? See, and yeah. hold on. What, because what kills me about that did. is it's yeah, barely even everything. anything. All it is is a mind fuck to get you to play the game more. That's it. They could have at least That's added. It. They could have br- like they're calling it games. They think they could have brought back Sparrow Racing. They could have made a point to the soccer fields and the hockey fields that are built into the game. Just made some fun, silly shit. But no, they call it Guardian Games. But you do nothing but the same shit you've been doing for over a year. Bounty That's section. Dumb. Fucking yeah, bounty section. Bounties inside of bounties inside of bounties. Who's got some fucking sweet jazz going uh, right now? That's probably Eugene. I bet you it's Eugene. He's started strong. <laughs> 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 Eugene's great. Why do you know he's a terrible liar when you can't see his face? Wait, 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 wait. Which one do you agree with, Drone? You got to tell me. A, B, C, I'm D, and Mikey D. So tell me which one you agreeing with. So I'm the one that gets blamed for everything. Because you have no discretion. We literally just talked for 25 minutes about how you literally told a whole group of police, fuck the police, and then you wonder why you get banned for shit? Thank you. Justin, you agree with Justin up here at the top? Yeah, probably. He was the one that was saying that it was just getting you to play the game. Oh, yeah. Joan, yeah. Joan agrees with you. Is what I was trying to figure out which guy. Thank you. Fuck I appreciate that. Yeah, you're joking. Hi, Melly. 
Um, I, I need to like. So do y'all guys want to just touch some of this video game stuff to get off of it, so we can talk about re regular stuff with uh, you know, with what Kim? Oh yeah, regular stuff with me. I yeah. play video games. I just don't. Well, play no, them actually, because I wanted, I, I did want to bring up the topic of streaming because you were doing it a little bit longer than all of us. I still consider myself really new to it. Right now, you are literally our stream guru. Okay, yeah. right, on that moment, let me take pause for just a second, just I have to say something. As officially of yesterday, I was streaming for a complete year now. Oh, nice. So next weekend, yes, thank you, thank you. I will have hit a affiliate on Twitch on the 9th. So I hit it exactly seven days later, as fast as you can physically get it, because you have to stream for several unique days. I got really lucky. Don't ask me how or why that happened, but I did. But next weekend, I am going to be doing a subathon slash dream reversary slash thing. And I really, really, really want you guys to come by at least say hi when I do it, by the way. It's going to be like a stream -a-thon. Like the more people do, the longer I stay on. So I might be on for up to 24 hours, and I'm going to be a little weird at the end. And there will be alcohol involved, but just say that. <laughs> It's going to be Saturday. I'm probably going to start air like around 4 or 5 in the afternoon, which is like 5 or 6 for you guys. And I'm originally going to go for 6 hours. A one-week stream, no stop. Somebody's going to have to drop a lot of fucking money for that. Yeah, that's going to be crazy. Happen. For real. But yes. But I have been streaming for a while now. I've been doing it for a year. I've been doing it hardcore for a year, too. Like bare minimum of five days a week for over a year i haven't taken a lot of time off and you so let me so let's ask you questions so you um because i want to learn too i've been learning okay. a lot justin's been passing down a lot of your knowledge to me but um you prefer so you stream on twitch mm -hmm. and you use um so you just stream, stream on twitch right and you use stream labs mm -hmm. I used stream last because most of it was already put together. Like I showed Justin, instead of having to sit here and physically make a thousand different scenes, they have right. the packages already made for you to just download and import, and then you can edit them and make them fit what you did. So what I did with my stream is like I downloaded a package and got like the pictures with all the cutouts already on it, where all the holes go, and then I just basically redecorated them, so to speak, with Photoshop to fit with what the theme I wanted to keep with. So I, you know, it was easier for me that way because I know some. Thank you for shouting out, drone, because drone's trying to hit his uh, affiliate too. Um, and Streamlabs, it's a lot less complicated to me than OBS. Like it gives you a starting point, whereas OBS is just like here. There you go. Yeah. Geez. Have you um <laughs> have you heard of Streamyards? No, I have not heard of that. Oh, you already we... have affiliate. That's right. I was telling um, my friend about Streamlabs OBS, and he mm -hmm. just, the show I just did before this, he was using, he decided to use this thing called StreamYards, and um, I'm assuming they're all kind of similar, but mm -hmm. when he did on, he streamed to YouTube, when somebody did put a comment, it like popped up real big on the screen, like, like, uh, as if it was like a banner or something. It was kind of cool. There's, like, there's lots of add-ons and stuff like that that are out there for Streamlabs that you can add uh -huh. on to do the same thing. Because I know, like, there's even one that if somebody puts an emote in your chat, it'll pop out across the screen. So it kind okay. of draws your attention. That's so, okay. like, especially because streaming, it's it's hard if you're focused on a game or something. You slip chat a little bit sometimes. Right. I do it myself, and I, I try really hard not to. But stuff like that would be is awesome because it pulls your attention back to it. And that's why I kind of have sound clips in my thing, and I use chat about to do this. Turn your clip. TV down, Eugene. It won't turn down. What's going on my TV? He's still he recording. Hard 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 hard. He started playing his PlayStation. Oh, also, so one thing is multi-stream. You're not allowed to multi-stream. Yes, I cannot stream at the same time on YouTube or anywhere else. It's theirs for 24 hours, and then I can put it somewhere else. <laughs> Now, I can't stop somebody from using my stream and doing it like Anthony. Anthony streams on YouTube. I'm not streaming on YouTube. Anthony is. I just have to be part of the call. My side and my version of what is going on is, is strictly on Twitch, which is, has to be for 24 hours as an affiliate. That's part of your affiliate agreement. I know nobody ever reads those things, but it is part of that. I didn't go in and read the whole thing, but there was a lot of things because at one point I was thinking about doing something maybe on Facebook instead of Twitch or YouTube or somewhere else. And I wanted to make sure I wasn't going to cross any lines because I know that once you start getting quote unquote paid by somebody, well, technically Twitch doesn't pay me, my viewers and stuff do, but they get a cut out of it. And they're the reason I can actually make money off of this. 
there's a lot of guidelines you have to go by. Since they want to make sure they get, you know what I think why they do that? They don't want you to do it simultaneously, and then you start to realize one other thing you yeah. maybe are doing better at. So you might be like, maybe I should take it and go over there, and it makes now, sense. Now, see, I can. You want to become partnered sometimes. See, this is the thing I've seen and talked to a lot of people who are partnered on Twitch, and a lot of people actually told me that they were better off when they weren't partnered and they were doing, doing better. It alone. They were doing it alone only because they weren't. There's more restrictions for partners, and yes, being coming partnered opens up more doors for you. But the way it is right now, like they've already made it where affiliates can make ad revenue on Twitch. If you if I run ads, I make ad revenue on it. I don't make as much as a partner would, but I still make you know 18 cents per ad that I run or whatever. You know, you can. We have more emote slots now, and they just open it up. Like emotes are a really big thing on Twitch. I know. I don't know if you guys understand this premise, but a lot of people will sub to a person just to have their emote. They'll never watch their stream in their life, but they think their emotes are cute and want to use them in other streams, and they will buy sub to you just to keep the emotes. So that emotes are a very big thing that pulls people into your chat. So both you boys need to figure them out. By well, the yeah, way. I need to yeah, holler at Jason can. because I love the artwork that he did for you. Shout out to St. Jason on Twitch. Shout out to Ch Jason. Jazzy, if you're still here, can you shout out Jason for me? He's officially my artist. I don't give a fuck. This man, he's the one that created my little created my logo, my booby logo. That is my official Nerdist Girl logo. Like, I'm going to get it copyrighted and everything. That's me. It's happening. And you can, you said something about, you could put, so when you become affiliate, you could put ads on your thing and get paid yes, by that. You, get, you can, there is, under your affiliate, so you can run ads. Like, you, it automatically runs ads. You need more emotes or you have one and it's this one. Like, I'm telling you. Jason and Jazzy do does emotes, too. I love Jazzy. Jazzy's the one that did my little um sub badges. And I love her stuff, too. Don't, don't take it wrong. Please, Jazzy, I love you and you know this. Vixie is your stream. See, and you have Vixie's emotes, and they're adorable. They're cute little foxes, and I'm telling you, emotes, that's another way. You know, once you become affiliated, you can get biddies. Biddies are another way. You're supported by your streamer. Biddies come part of your streamer check. That's another way. You can get, you can have a donation link open in your, yeah, um... Different terminologies of biddies. No, I'm I right, get I'm biddies right. <laughs> They're legit called biddies, though, in the in Twitch. They, they're called biddies. And and that's why all the girls are like biddies for the titties. That's funny. It's hilarious. But, um... Really? really yeah. Hold up. Nerdish, do you have a link to your Amazon wish? <laughs> I'm rocking my biddy shirt. Down there, I do. And I actually, I need to... Hey, Mike, my how do you see wish. that? I need somebody's help who's good with computer crap, because I need to put some upgraded shit I'm on my list. Hold huh? up, Kim. Finish telling me about the um the ads, though. The ads, yes. You can run them. You know how, okay, if you're not subbed to a channel, you know if you go to it, you see the ad at the beginning of it? Right. If you're an affiliate, you get money for having that ad turned on. It's not a right. lot of money. It'll add up slowly, but it is fucking money. It's more than you would get if you didn't. You know, you could have the choice to turn it off, too. When you're an affiliate, like, if I get up to do a be right back, I can run a 30-second ad break while I'm going pee and make money off of that 30-second ad break. Hi, Kyrell. Oh, that's something I Kyrell didn't think says about. Kyrell says hi. Yeah. Like, when you do your be right back, I never do it either because I always forget that I have the option to do it. But you right. can throw up, like, a 30-second up to, I think, a one-minute and 30-second ad break. And for every 30 minutes you stream, you could do one. So if you, you, you do whenever, your beginning. Whenever I go to watch Justin's stuff, it, it, an ad pops up at first. That's because you're not sub to him. If you're not subbed to him, you're going to get that initial ad at the beginning unless they yeah, turn it off. But won't he get so, money for that? Won't he get paid for that ad I just have to should, watch? He should make at least like a couple cents off of you watching that. Yeah, it's a couple cents if you watch the ad. But the idea is you don't get paid till you like make your first $100. Yeah, Twitch, no, you have way. to make a $100 in a 30-day, like you have the month. So like the month just started on the 1st, right? So you have from May 1st till May 30th to make $100 if you want to get a payout. If you make the $100 or more, you get that payout. It'll come on April 5th. Or, yeah, wait. Next is not April. What am I talking about? June 15th, right? If you don't, it'll roll over to June, and it'll keep rolling over until you make $100, and then you'll get paid out the next month. Cool, though. That's cool. Random yeah, check is. for $100 in, like, two years. <laughs> yeah, right? Look. 
hey, it's money. You you're playing video games anyway. Nah, I, hey, I bet. Fuck it. <laughs> like you, I mean, people like you, and I don't know about Anthony because he, well, he's got his unemployment, so he's fine because he's making big baller bucks right now with that extra six hundred. Um, uh, like for me, it's baller. great because right now I'm not even like the only income I have coming in is whatever I make on Twitch. I, because I was in the process of finding another job, and then all this COVID stuff happened, and then like timing, and like when I have, I have my nieces all day, so like the only time I can really work is at night, and like it's hard to find jobs. And basically, I'm trying to do something, you know what I mean? And I was doing stuff like uh, Instacart, or um, we had this thing here. It's called Jive, where you go basically stock for the store for a little bit and doing stuff like that when I could. But I'm not doing that shit now because fuck that. I'm not going to a store unless I have to. But yeah, so well, thank you for the ten biddies, Jerome. <laughs> but like, yeah, I push to make my gamer girl check. That's what I call it every month. Like, if I make my gamer girl check every month, I'm happy. I mean, it's a hundred extra dollars in my pocket or more. You know, thank you for the follow. So, in, uh, I can't read that, but thank you. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm not even gonna try to butcher the name. Nah, I'm not gonna bro. try to butcher it. You can break it down for me I'm in chat, or I'm gonna call you so I'm not worth it. I'm good at butchering names, but um, yeah, that's what I do. That's why I have my my and like I'm trying to find my gimmicks. And like every successful streamer, in my opinion, has knows their niche, and they have their like not uh, gimmick might not be the right word, but it's their thing they do that to entertain gimmick, whatever you want to call it. And my gimmick has somehow I started being be right back. Okay, Kyra, I'll be here. I started out just being you know the girl who kind of knows how to play games and was kind of bad at it, and now I've come turned into the fake titty streamer mm -hmm. where I. I am a girl who streams that has tits, yes. I'm not afraid to show the fact that I have tits, but I'm not like, hey, big boys, give me all your money now. Okay, yeah, okay, right. I'm not doing going to that extent to be the titty streamer. I'm not a Twitch <laughs> Twitch only needs one alinity, I'm sorry. So, so you don't have but, one of them, you don't have one of them IG, uh, IG accounts, Kim? I have an Instagram account, but it literally is nothing but pictures of me right before I go on stream. Or you don't, you don't have a, you don't have a fan only account? Now, see, we've oh, talked about this. Oh, God. Listen, I had a whole pants off podcast about should Nerdish make a fans only account. Well, I remember you said something about you found pictures and something, something. Yeah, I have pictures. I have plenty of pictures because apparently when I get drunk, I like to take pictures. That's not the point. The problem <laughs> is, I, I have a lot of pictures that you could see things that you don't get to see on stream. And I have a lot of pictures that you can just see better angles of what you get to see on stream and what you don't. But I'm like, is that enough for, to make somebody want to sub to me? Because I'm not out here like, I don't have a dude here to be putting like dick sucking videos on there for it or something well, like that. Well, we're into the time, may as well. I mean, what? Yo. Let me do, how am I going to poof some dude here? OnlyFans is popping right now. Though. <laughs> like, right now would be the time for me to do it if I was going to do it. Plus, I have a niche. I'm a BDW. I'm a big bitch that actually has ass and titties, so that's something people want to hear and see. But <laughs> then again, I'm like freaked out. Should I link it to Twitch? Should I let people know? Because I have enough trolls issue, and I know trolls don't bother me. I could give two fucks less about trolls. I get mm. called a fat bitch job of the Hutt's wife. Like, Justin, you've seen him come in here and go yes, off on me yes, and stream. Like, nightly. That shit does not bother me. It that's bothers... Good. Everybody else in my chat, though, and they try to become my little knights and go after these people. I'm like, y'all, it's not even that serious. Let them now, get their you, little, you, you know. Hey, Kim. I ban them, yes. Kim, Kim. Yes, yes. When people want to crusade, they will crusade. I know, you but stop I... it. You can just embrace it and rally the crowd. Hi. And, and you know what's cool is uh, you do have a good personality for this stuff, and especially when you could, you, people, opinions don't bother you, then that's good. If you can make fun of yourself. So that's cool. Oh, I, I always say, listen, the first thing you're going to make fun of me is being fat. I'm like, make fun of me for my mouth or my fucking thin and hairline. Be original. Like, I'm, you're fat. Oh, my God. I've never heard that before. Oh, my God. My no God. Really? Yeah, right. Your I eyes are a great observation. Mirror, like, make fun of this giant fucking pimple on my face I have right now. His name is Fred, by the way. 
That's why I made. That's why I made my video and oh put in it. God. Listen, I'm giving y'all full Thank full advantage so to make fun of me. What did Nacho I, do? Nacho, Nacho, you hit me up four hundred biddies. Thank you, Nacho. Dropping them biddies, Nacho. That is all. I think that's the first time I've ever got biddies off my channel. <laughs> Uh, Nacho hey, took hey. your took your bitty cherry. Let's go. Hey, hey, yo. We, we are working over this, Jay. I'd support if I was in a financial place. The only thing I can do is give you my prime sub. So you, I, that's hey, girl, and I appreciate that. Yes, you got it. You got it next month. You got it next. Are we month. rotate? And let's go. Yes. <laughs> Yes, all of you who have time, if you're not giving your sub to either Justin, myself, or Anthony, shame, shame on y'all. That's a free yeah. sub you could be giving to one of us. I gave my sub to myself. <laughs> you already sub to yourself for free. Yeah, but I made a sock account to sub to myself. Why? What are you sub What's the sub thing if you got Amazon Prime? I don't get it. Okay, if you have Amazon Prime and you link mm -hmm. your Prime to your Twitch account, you right. get a free sub that you can give somebody every month. Yeah, you'll have yeah. they get a full like they I get the full oh, two forty five or oh, whatever no, I get for each. <laughs> Wait, what is she talking about, pussy? She said I'll always pay for pussy. <laughs> oh wait, who what? Hmm? Ooh, that's Nacho. That's my oh uh, guys. Uh <laughs> Because Gene had pepper on the, on the, in the oh, chat. Oh, you Gene had pepper in the back. Okay. Get your cat back. Make me some money, bitch. Oh, my God. <laughs> Here. I'm uh, doing good, bro. Look, hey, Pepper. I, listen, the one thing. So, is it, yes, Nacho, so that, so that is Pepper. Oh, that God. is Pepper. Listen, he's just about to bring me bring my cat to me. I got three of them. <laughs> I got two, but only one likes to get on camera. Gee, Jeremy Shy. You gonna let them pimp out your pepper like that, man? As long as I get hey, some, man. as long as I get some for seeds from it. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know, we don't have to get you a burger at some point. I'll pay Thank you back. You pay me back for that phone bill. You're gonna I'm call him Sona. I'm gonna call him Sona I'm, too. I'm getting upset because my um, my widgets aren't working. Your alerts? Yeah, my bits alert is not working. But thank is you for the 400 bits, Nacho. Uh, do you have it on the scene? I definitely do. Do you have it on? I've seen a like, thing pop up on the screen. That little uh, purple looking thing just popped up. Yeah, it's not supposed to be that. It's supposed to be this. <laughs> See it yet? The wed yeah, the widgets. There's something going on with all the widgets because mine are delayed. Some people aren't getting them at all. There's, I think it's something to do with the latency going on right now. But everybody who in here in my chats and streams is saying they're having issues too. But thank you, Nacho. I greatly appreciate it. <laughs> well, yeah, I do little gimmicky things that make people want to interact. Like I have video alerts set for a specific number of bits that will pop up certain things. Like I have one for 69 bits because Choco picked 69. And if you hit 69 bits, It'll play the song My Milkshake Brings All the Boys to the Yard and you see Choco sitting there shaking his titty like this. It's funny stuff. Like I try and I try to bring my viewers into the chat as much as possible. Like I have a way for you to get your own command with sound in my chat. I have a way for you to, you know, if you're here long enough and I think you're part of this community far enough, you get your VIP badge in my channel. And I tend to give VIP badge like, hey, I need a new video alert. Pick a number, send me a, you know, a GIF. And a sound clip, and it'll be your video alert. You can pick yeah, it out. I'm glad you're here. And when you, I feel like when you interact with people, it goes better. It goes better. People come to your chat that are actually here. I'm not talking about trolls, but the people who come to talk to you, they want interaction. So you have to focus on your chat. Say hi to Sona. I have some Final Fantasy R streams myself lately. You stopped at chapter eight. Um, that's cool. I haven't played the remake yet. I didn't play the original either. The yeah, only Final Fantasy I ever played was it. But it's going to take away from everything else that I'm playing. That's right. Well, like, Final Fantasy? I, I play my normal games, and I have one game I'm really looking forward to that's coming out in June. Like, I'm really looking forward to it. What's that? The Final uh, Fairy Tale RPG is coming out June. I to get my cat. Fuck it. And I want it. Because Fairy Tale is an anime that I've watched completely. I read all the manga I fell in love with. I, you know. That's just one of those ones I love. I need to watch more, I know, and a lot of people hate it, but whatever. I want that fucking game. Could you well, let's, you, let's use um, oh, no, let's use that. I mean, you be jamming to the accordion music. 
probably. Well, Kevin, having... let's use that to segue into um real quick. We could just discuss. We all, a bunch of us, was looking forward to uh, Streets of Rage Four, and now that it's actually out, we could just kind of you know. Look, I didn't really play the original three games, but I've seen Justin play it now. I've seen Saint Jason play it now, and mm-hmm. I want the fucking game. Like, that and that's not even my kind of game. Fine, yo. The game well, yeah. is beautiful. Like it's it's yeah. it's updated and it's it still has game. that old school nostalgia look to it. Yeah. But it looks amazing. And, and that's I think, good. I think one thing it does great is what Mike was saying. Mike said if he got Final Fantasy, he wouldn't play nothing else. Sharice Rage is a game you could pop in and out, in and out. You could just throw like exactly. I've been playing it with my family. So I've been playing it with my daughter, my wife, my stepson. Uh, my, my son's friends been coming over and we could just play it for an hour or two and then turn it off and go about your life. Whereas some games consume you and that's all you play. Yeah. Like I want the damn game. I'm like, but do I want to get it now on PC or do I want to hold up and get my PlayStation first to play it on PlayStation so I can play with other people I know? Like that's my yeah, big that's thing. Like, I need to get a PlayStation is what I need to do so I can actually get games on there and play with you guys. <laughs> and not for nothing, I could have got it for free and didn't pay for it because it's on uh, Xbox Game Pass, but I specifically bought it for PlayStation so I could play with, you know, uh, specifically Eugene and Justin, which I haven't played with either of them yet, but... <laughs> oh. The game rocks, yo. For real. Oh, yeah, now, that, now that, Chris, me and you... Your me and you gotta is play for the next. Me and you, okay, have you beat it yet, Dub? Now. What'd you say? Have you beat you, it yet, you, Anthony? You beat it? Yeah, yeah, I beat it before. Remember, I had beat it uh, when you was you and Eugene was still playing it. Okay. Hey, I'm down to beat it, it again. Me and still... Eugene beat I'm it. Say, you beat the game, which is we were just talking about the other time, is how games don't have a way to quote unquote beat them anymore. Right, they're, they're just endless. Endless. But you beat the game, right? And surprise, right. surprise, you still want to go back and play the they're game. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, I've never a been a fan. I've like I've never played those games when I was younger, partly because I wasn't around that kind of stuff. But it's not my quote unquote. If you look at my repertoire of games, Streets of Rage Four would not be like when you'd fly hey. up in there. But hey, I want to play this fucking game. Hey, um, actually, real quick, Kim, you brought up a good game, um, Brawlhalla. Brawlhalla. We need to all get in some Brawlhalla. Yeah, it is crossover. I can play with you guys on my PC. And I play with a controller on it too. So that shit's actually fun as hell too. It's fun. It's, it's basically free. like um, because what were you playing for a little while, Dub? You were playing um, that PlayStation, yeah, the PlayStation All Stars, it's like um, Smash Brothers. Yeah, it's basically yeah. what Brawlhalla is. It's like Smash, but it's free. No, here's the thing. I'm the free guy. I was playing Brawlhalla when it came out for free, like over a year yeah. ago. Trust me. I I go. I'm I'm really good at Brawlhalla. I actually got, unlock my favorite character, which is a werewolf dude. That's my dude right there. Because if you play it long enough, you'll unlock certain characters. Yeah, because that's just like, okay, with most games like that that are free to play, you can right. either buy characters or if you play long enough, you get coins right. or in-game currency to right. unlock. It might not unlock all of them, right. but you can unlock certain ones. So it's like, even with like Dead by Daylight, you get certain yeah, characters with the game, but you play long enough and you can unlock the, the non-licensed characters. You have right. to buy the licensed ones, but still. Yeah. Yeah, I was telling you guys about Brawl Huller a while ago, but, you know, everybody yeah. was into Destiny, so y'all looked at me like, what? Another game? <laughs> All right, whatever. Oh, God, hold on. Wait a minute. We got a new daddy in stream right now. Nacho just dropped a thousand biddies for the titties and the pussies. New daddy and new pussy for the real. Sorry, boys. I got to fix this. You know I have to do it. Let me go. Wait, wait, where, where's daddy? I got to fix it. Okay. See, we about to have a problem. See? No, we're not having no. 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 Hold on. I got to fix it. I got to make sure. Oh, snap. I forgot tomorrow is the day that. Oh, yeah. Tomorrow is May the 4th. It's my daughter's uh, birthday. Let's, let's talk about dad and Disney's bullshit. I don't know. We, we, got, we, got, we got two birthdays tomorrow. <laughs> Who's else? Who birthday is it tomorrow also? Franco. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's right. Yep, I got a pepper meme all queued up for him. That's that's hilarious because Disney's and Lucas are on some real bullshit about tomorrow. Oh, Star Wars Day, right? Yeah, basically they've made it to where anytime anyone tweets anything with the hashtag made a fork, they own it. Really? They can suck a big one. Yeah. Are you serious? I'm gonna tell my daughter. Yeah. They, they they put up 
it was like to celebrate they own the trademark or whatever for Metaphorp. So anyone who uses it in a hashtag, they own it. Oh, they don't owe you any royalties or you can't be accredited or none of it. Wait, hold on. I know this has nothing to do with what we're talking about, but I need to address this because this is going down in my chat right now. You ditched me for a pussy appointment? It's okay. Was it good, though? <laughs> if it was good pussy, then I, it's allowed. But if it was not, yes, you wouldn't ditch for lame pussy. Okay, that's good, Nacho. Because if you ditch Stream me for going. some lame pussy, <laughs> we ain't doing it. Y'all is nuts. <laughs> All right, we can go back to it, Mac. Sorry. Thank you, Nacho. You have your daddy command. You should be able to use it. Go ahead and drop that uh, hash exclamation point, daddy. Hey, what's the weather supposed to be at, like tomorrow? Um, it's 100 degrees right now here. Damn. That's Texas. That is Texas. That's why exactly. I need to leave Texas. <laughs> Man, it's, 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 hey, it's nice in Jersey. Too bad a bitch can't go nowhere. <laughs> can you see you come back up, what, try to come back up in this year? I am, for real. Got, got a location in mind? Would have been next month. I Well, no. Next month would have just been a... Right, a visit. A visit. Hold on, who just dropped the damn money? We know, I know who it was. Right, dropping money. Y'all about to make me start being back on my damn Twitch account. Oh, I'm the only person that became affiliate and stopped streaming on Twitch. Imagine that. Oh, switch way to Blaze unlocked. Okay, so, okay. Just, all right, Justin. <laughs> all right, Justin. Justin being Patty and Trish did it to take daddy back from Nacho. <laughs> It's no. Yeah. If you still here, Nacho, I love you. <laughs> Damn it! Just saying. <laughs> well, so we we mentioned the streets of rage. Um, we mentioned the streaming. Uh, and what else you want to? Um, oh yeah, and then uh, Eugene and True also mentioned a little bit of that. Um, uh, the Last of Us. Make me money. Go right ahead. They talked about the Last of Us. Right. Yeah, and then like it was safe. They didn't spoil nothing. That's cool. What uh, is there anything else specifically I want to talk about? You want to uh, throw out there? The only game good enough for me that it was her. Oh, you got birthday pussy? What? I don't see any other good games for you. Petty. You petty. <laughs> you petty. <laughs> So um, uh, what else did I want to? Oh, I wanted to uh, talk about the FGC for those who actually care. Well, you've been to Evo, technically, right. Anthony. Right. Yeah, so yeah, Evo, Evo got, got canceled, canceled this year. year. We so all I, knew it was gonna happen. Well, yeah, we all knew it was gonna happen. We were hoping it would. So, we were hoping June would come around and we'd be over this thing, but we are not. You just cut in and out again, Mike. Mike, what did you Mike. say? Do you have your... Do you even care that he's cutting it out? Mike. He can't hear that, have... Gene. Wait, 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 not... wait. Mikey, do you... what is, is your voice activity level low or high? Because you need... I think that's what's happening is you talk so soft <clears throat> and you're so far away from your mic. Oh, shit. Not <laughs> <laughs> Let the tug of war begin. She making you work. <laughs> She's making me work. She just dropped another thousand biddies on me. Oh, oh my, my god! All right, all right, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm, I'm gonna let her have it. <laughs> <laughs> she can have that. Mikey, I think you need to adjust your voice to talk because your uh your activity because it's you're cutting out and you talk too low. I was about to say, Jay, sound like they're trying to make you waste that stimulus, Jake. They'd be like, nah, not so, not so good. <laughs> so so you make so me daddy is what I say to that. As For now, I say. <laughs> I'm For laughing now. more so because I got mine, but I still haven't gotten my tax return yet. So did they go off of your 2019 taxes, or they gave, went off your 2018? I'm assuming they, they went off 2018 if I got it before I got my tax return. Gotcha. Probably. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You could feel something Justin doing something. He said he's going to let her have it. We'll see. But it is back in your corner, Nacho. See, that's another... The, I Going back to streaming, that's another thing I did. 
It encourages people because let's be honest, people, a lot of people have that needing to be the winner. What is it called? The the competitive edge to them. And something <laughs> simple as like making the daddy command actually made me make sure I, I hit my gamer girl check every month. Doing something simple like that because people go back and forth like, oh, for ten dollars I can get a command and you know get the it's an attention thing or it's just somebody trying to help me make some money. It's cool. See, you say that, but I had an idea for when I start continuously streaming once I finish getting everything set up. I wanted mm-hmm. to do like a leaderboard, and depending on how that works out, uh-huh. at like the end of the month, whoever's the top leader, I let them suggest a game that I either get on PS4 or Steam. Well, see, you can put a leaderboard. I've heard of people that do that. Streamlabs has a leaderboard, and it will keep track of subs. It'll keep back track of donations. It'll keep track of biddies. It'll keep track of gifted subs, and it'll tell you who gave you the most gifted subs. Who gave you know? And there's one that'll even tell you who spent the most time in your stream, so you know who's actually out here supporting and stuff like that. And that's another thing. Like, there's a lot of resources out there that'll help you track stuff like that. This True. is like I've already found a timer for when I do my subathon that'll automatically update anytime somebody drops biddies or money or subs and stuff like that, so I don't have to keep track of that stuff myself. Because let's be honest, first of all, I'm a noodle head. I'm going to forget. Second of all, there's going to be alcohol involved. I ain't going to be remembering shit halfway through a 24 hour stream. <laughs> okay. I'm going to be tired as fuck, drunk as hell, acting dumb. I don't know. Like, it's going to be funny. But then it goes back to what you were saying about I'm still trying to figure out the niche that I can fit in because the main things I play are JRPGs, shooters, <sighs> and every once in a while, Monster Hunter. But see, there's yeah, shooters. The thing, okay, this is my He's thing. Awake. I would play shooters just for fun, but shooters on Twitch are only good if you are good at the game. Nobody yeah. wants to see somebody who can't play the fucking game. Like... And that, that's that's where I fall in that rough spot. There are games where I'm good and games where I'm god awful. But that's just like, I play League, and I don't play, like, regular League. I don't play Summoner's Rift. I'll occasionally play ARAM, but I've been playing a lot on TFT. TFT has gotten to the point where it's growing, and a lot of people like it because it's bounced off that Dota chess thing. It's a battle but chess. I'm not good enough in TFT to pull the numbers off of TFT alone. But the first sure. thing, when new people come to my channel and they ask me what rank I am, I'm like, I'm gold. Well, I just got the gold. I was in silver because I really don't play a lot of rank because I like playing the game for fun. But if I got in there, and I, I guarantee you if I sat down and actually focused and played more ranked and got myself higher, I could probably pull in a bigger audience from that. Kim, your thing is, you could tell instantly, your thing is you're, you have a personality. So people are going to watch you for your personality. Not yeah, even the game. So you, could, play games. Yeah, you, could, you could play or do anything, but they're going to watch you for you. Um, like that's literally your niche is you, like pe- your personality. Um, true. My question for you is, what else do you need to do to get started? Because I know a little while ago you were talking about doing this. What, what, what do you need to, else? It's more so me trying to get my setup as far as Streamlabs and everything set up on my end because I am trying to do a lot. Like but right you, now, do you? If you need help with that, I'm here. Yeah, I mean, we Justin literally walked me through. I never Justin use OBS ever, and Justin walked me through OBS and then Streamlabs. Um, and if you're planning on doing it with your PS4 through your computer or whatever, Justin's probably better to go to because he already has all that set up. Oh, I, 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 already got, I already got all that set up. Like, right now, I got my Switch plugged into my Elgato, plugged into my PC. When I play my PS4, I run it through the um, remote play that I screen capture and stream through Twitch. It's more, it's more so about getting the odds and end for how I want my stream to look and feel set up. That if I was you, I would just start off now. You sound like you got everything to get started, and then you'll add on layers because I feel like you're waiting for the little small stuff and you keep you putting yourself on hold, just waiting for that. Oh, know, no, no, no. I, stream, I stream every Friday and Saturday for about two, three hours. You, okay, you don't do it on Twitch, do you? Yeah, why don't I ever get like a notification because I'm on? Yeah, yeah what's your thing? I'll, I'll follow you, what and do you I get? follow you. Because, like, yesterday I was streaming for about two hours playing Killing Floor 2. Wait, what's how can, you never, put it, how can S- you never put it in the J chat? I'll follow you. Is it SCW or am I dyslexic? It, it, it's CSW. C- CSW. I went dyslexic. I didn't know your uh, channel was up and running. 
Yes, like, that's definitely. true. He is one of the. Bo- Actually, I should have just done this because I put his thing in here. Like I, en- I've gotten back to playing my roguelike. So like Friday, I was streaming Hades. Hey, Mikey, are you in my channel? Because I want you to see this. What I did for you. No, you don't even follow me, do you? You can't even free follow your friend. <laughs> You know, Eugene was my 500th follower, just so you know. Yeah, yeah. But none of my friends follow me. They're like, who the fuck me? I'm pretty sure I follow Man, I was following you. I was leaving the conversation. Y'all know what you're talking about. Eugene, I didn't know you was doing anything. Yep, you know, yep. Mm-hmm. Plus, you can't complain. Look, you got I the biggest following out of all of us. You actually do have the have biggest like following out of all of us. So why is you crying? YouTube. Shut the fuck up. 7,000. And plus... <laughs> And my um my last week's favorite video got got um got flagged. Oh, okay, there shit. Are you ready? Listen, are can you hear my stream? Just fight that shit. Can you hear it's it? It's not that hard either. Dude, I fought that shit right, on one of my on, um I'm one of my DJ mixes. Mikey, hear what I did for him. You ready? Yeah. No, uh, when I stream Two Dre Four that day, got copyright claimed. I can hear it. See what I did for you. If you need it, like, that's what I meant it by It got itself. copyrighted for what? It did not get copyrighted. Oh, his channel did, yeah. No, it got copyright claimed. It got copyright claimed because probably some of the music in the game, which you just go into, you basically, they give you a menu that you can go in there and basically fight that. Yeah. But was your you video do... still allowed to play or was it not allowed to play? So, nah, so here, yeah. let me, let me jump I, in I, there, I, I got the I got the whole, it, it can be monetized, but I won't receive revenue from it. Right, right, well, That's just right. going to happen. Here, yeah, here's the, here's the thing. I want to, I want to, I beg to thank Eugene be on some BS. So I stream. Uh, Justin, did, did I not see the email that I get every time I get on BS? Well, I streamed uh, Streets of Rage 4 for over four hours. I streamed the whole game, beating it from start to finish. I streamed the boss battle. I streamed everything for four, like four hours, and I didn't get a copyright claim at all. Now, maybe you had, I don't know if you had music, your own music playing in the background at some point. Nope. Yeah, I don't I know. Mm. And well, somehow, Eugene, only, every, only stuff happens to Eugene. <laughs> Well, I can't, you know, I can't even say that in this case. I will say, because YouTube is fucked up. YouTube will do that. They will hit some people, and they will not hit some people. And the thing like, is, is, once they hit you, they come back and keep checking your ass, and that's probably whenever, they, whenever I got hit, yeah. times, whenever I got hit, it was I, it was meant for something. Like I got hit because I was playing a song in more than thirty seconds. So if you play in continuous more than thirty seconds of music, you're gonna get hit. Oh, and, less than that, like, but yeah. Um, you know, that's why the sound clips on my channel, like the ones that I, I play for people's like intros and stuff, are 15 seconds or less. See, yeah, you can it, cut like, it up purpose. when like, here's think the about thing. It. I did the club COVID, and that mm-hmm. was a 30 minute video, and Justin was playing sets in there, but you never heard something that long without you hearing me screaming in the background. Right. So, as long as you and talk in, it doesn't count. So, that's they what happens get you. when I do my when I do my Saturday, my club quarantine on the weekends. Uh, every Saturday, eight o'clock, right here on Twitch.tv slash DJ Justin Love. Uh, go, check it out. I just sent you. I just sent you a screenshot of the email I got. I believe you got the email. That's not you the point. You gotta fight it though. I don't well, even care I, anymore. Basically, well, when I do it on Twitch, how did you send it to me? I recorded no in my. I recorded in my DJ software, oh. so it's clean, right? You don't hear me talking over it. But when I do it on Twitch, I try to talk over each song a little bit. This way. If I decide I want to move it over to YouTube, they don't flag it. Twitch doesn't mute it. Like, my most recent ones haven't been muted lately, which is actually pretty cool. But uh, that's what they'll do. They'll mute it because because even Twitch, you're technically not supposed to do that. Uh-huh. Franco's back. Franco's back. Well, you know, how- uh, Eugene got a point. I bet you what happened to you and didn't happen to me was... Mind you, I was playing with my wife, my daughter, and my stepson, and the whole time we're screaming and ah, oh, oh. so yeah, there yeah. probably isn't <laughs> that much and time. And Eugene plays with no voice or camera. Right, right. He doesn't yeah, even right. like t- talk or anything, does he? No, does he, like, no, no, no voice or camera. See, so if all they have is the game audio to go go off of, yeah, they're gonna flag you, dude. 
Yeah, you're right. Yeah, because I was watching your one stream, Eugene, and you you said like barely anything, and then you was like, "Oh man." Good? Yeah, no, like, yeah. So I get it. Yeah. You, Eugene is the guy that needs to make the compilation <laughs> videos, not the stream live. Because he doesn't. Interact. <laughs> he just kind of sits there. You gotta be there to interact with him. Yeah. With that, or he need to start doing game reviews. Yeah, that's like Eugene look like he got a screensaver on right now. He did. <laughs> yeah, he's sitting like, there playing PlayStation. That guy's screen frozen. He's playing Streets of Rage right now. What are you talking about? Eugene would, I'm telling you, Eugene would have a good niche. He could just have like no discretion gaming and he'd be like the next Angry Joe. He'll hate like everything, trash talk everything. Like it, it's his does personality. It. That's why he has so 1100 subs niche. on his YouTube because he used to make videos just crying about oh. shit. Or he just need to do like a jerky boys thing. Just start prank calling people and recording. <laughs> Don't get that boy no idea. Build his ass out of jail. You used to call and say all the time when people you were to rip people's assholes open and shit in them back. In I the never day. said that. That was Eugene, not me. <laughs> I got audio. You don't got no audio. Yo, Eugene straight put it on on the uh, Sandy and Anthony show that one day. Uh -huh. That was hilarious. I told you you recite it. Yeah, look, Ray no, Sandy did. Sandy did. She read it. I, I was hoping you recite it. Oh, nah. You got to do it for the. I told Justin. Time. Justin is one person. I'll recite it for him, y'all. I'll let him. I'll let him record it. <laughs> I'll straight go into the studio and have him, and I'll uncut back in the day style and let him record it. The first well, thing you need to know is I'm a kind of a tree. Jump off doing thing. three somersault flips. Yeah. Watching my nets. <laughs> oh, good times. Are you on the porch, good sir? Oh, get the fuck. Enjoying that good weather? It's beautiful out here. Yeah. You know what's sad? I just got thrown so out of the camera. Like I was food shopping or whatever. Mm -hmm. I literally left at one o'clock to go to Krispy Kreme. That's all I was supposed to be doing. <laughs> <laughs> How did that work out? Damn. Wait, did you left at one o'clock to go to Krispy Kreme? It's 5.30. My G. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Did you did you keep getting the calls like, oh, can you go here? Can you go here? Oh, no, 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 no. I was in the car with Tijana, and we went to Krispy Kreme, and then I said I needed to stop at Walmart just to grab. What did I stop there to grab? You need don't even know. Even know. Just like some bread and some, some hot dogs going to grill tomorrow or something, right? That stop turned into all kinds of other shit. Oh, then, man. all the way back to Trenton, we ended up at Audi's, the liquor store. Oh, you drink it, huh? Jesus. So on the one side, I, I was like, damn, it took like mad long. But on the other side, kind of worked out to my favor. Hey, Franco, did are you getting Streets of Rage? Did you get it yet? Bro, I was playing Streets of Rage last night. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was yeah, so mad playing that game. Getting... Now, hold on. And you got the Predator also? I bought Predator the other day. I just ain't started up yet. Nice. I'm probably yeah. going gonna, to, um, right before I go to bed tonight, just throw it in the PlayStation and let it uh, do what it gotta do. Got you. Okay. But uh, it was funny because oh, I started cool. playing um, Street of Rage and I got my, so mad. That was really at what you do? You you want to stop that, Eugene? Damn. <laughs> oh, he's been doing that the See, whole street. The whole street. You hear his phone. You hear his PlayStation. Uh, you hear TV. You hear the cat. You hear everything. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but his yeah, cat got I, Justin some bitty, so leave that cat alone. <laughs> nah, yeah, he can bring started, Pepper into the chat all day. Yeah, I started playing and I got mad because I'm like, what took them so long to do this? Because it's literally Streets of Rage. Yeah. Just with updated graphics. And I was like, I don't want to play no old ass style game no more. And then I played it and was like, I think this is what I've been missing. This in is my what game. you Yes. Okay. I, need, yes. I need this in my life. For real. Like, I can literally just sit there and just play Streets of Rage. And I seen there's an online thing where you can like link up with other people. I was like, nah, I gotta play through the story mode first. Like yes. I just gotta play. So oh, you could you I could like have people you could 
you can have someone playing the story mode with you online. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I've seen that. But I don't like them cops, though, with the shields. Oh, yeah, them cops with the shields suck. <laughs> yeah, that game is actually difficult, man. It's not an easy no, game. No, it's not an easy it game is. on normal. I was like, oh, yo. But you know what? It's like Streets of Rage of old. It, it was challenging. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You literally had to play the old Streets of Rage to beat it with somebody else. Yay. Right. If you beat that and single player, you were... It's going to make this one so good. It's like, yeah. I want to play it with somebody now, else. You know what's cool, though, Franco? You could have a lot of fun at home with your kids because it's four players. Couch co-op. I know. Yeah. This is something that it, I'll let them play. Yeah. Like, I've been playing with Sandy, my daughter, and her son. We've been rocking. This is something I think we'll, we'll end up playing. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, I'm, I'm actually about to call my son Roman and, and ask him if he wanted. And, and buy it on his account. Download it to me and he'll play online together. <laughs> you, how, you guys don't do the, the, um, do the share? PlayStation share? So you don't have to pay for it again? Wait. So if I play station share with him, we can play the same game together? So that's what I do um, with Sandy. So I, every time I buy a game, I have it on my play, my PlayStation and Sandy's PlayStation. Yeah, but okay. you just got to be on the same IP address. The same no, connection. no, let me, let me explain it, because I don't know if you know how it goes, Eugene. This is the thing. is You just have to make the, his PlayStation the primary uh, PlayStation. That's all. So you make his the primary PlayStation, and then whenever you buy it, just uh, down in, uh, install it on his PlayStation. And then just go on his PlayStation, go on your account, install the game, right? So you can buy it on whatever PlayStation, install it on his, and then just get out of it, let him jump back in his, and he'll be playing it. And you can play together. We, I do all my games like that. The Predator, I feel like I'm Reese the Rage, hearing some like backwater bootleg. No, no, no. Sony allows Sony allows you to do it with only two accounts. So you, they used to let you do it with four. You could only do it with they two used accounts. To do it with five. I go walk. It's real easy. <laughs> all, it's real easy if you so if my, you think about doing it. My PlayStation needs to be the primary at all times. Yeah, his just his system. His system, not his account. Just the system. So don't look at it as the account. His that system just needs to be the primary system. So all you do is go in his room. Go on uh, his system. So go on his system, purchase it on my account, though. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's what yeah. Um, Adam do. Yeah. It, yeah. Okay. It's, it's simple. And it, it, it then you don't have to spend the extra money. And worst case scenario, yeah. if things do go sideways, you call up Sony and you tell them to just reset all your systems. And it wipes them all clean. It deactivates. It doesn't wipe the content. It wipes the Not activation. You. He's just saying, like, if, let's say, he couldn't remember his... For whatever reason, you couldn't get in the password. Like, you couldn't remember his password or something to get in his account for whatever crazy reason. So, okay. there's really nothing scary about it, but... Yeah, Sony will reset the activation. I can just sign into his account on my PlayStation and purchase it next time. The next thing I purchase, and then he can go in it on his, right? Yeah. No, hold up, hold up. So... Back. In I'm order them to going share it, you have to buy it on your account. So you could, so let's say, let me make it real simple. Your PlayStation in your bedroom, his PlayStation in his bedroom. You go on your account, you buy it like you always do. All you do is go on mm -hmm. his PlayStation, log in your account, and then go into options and click uh, activate as primary PlayStation. And then just download the game from your account on his PlayStation. And then all he do is mm -hmm. jump back on his account and bam, that's it. That is that simple. Like but if I had you to leave his place in the primary. Yeah, just just his system, not his account, but just his system with as the primary oh, okay. system. Yeah, it's real simple. Right. I could you could do it in like less than like two minutes. It's simple because that's what we do. Sounds like a plan. Yeah, man, it'll save you some money, you know. Speaking of money, what up with my my neck hanging? Yo, I I, I just. <laughs> I just said to Sandy the other day, I said, yo, because she ordered something from uh, Five Below and had it delivered here. I said, yo, I need to order that thing. She was like, why are you ordering another one? I was like, because I'm getting Franco one. I just didn't do it yet. I'm going to do it right now. This guy, man. Funny part is I went on Five Below, but I don't know what it's called, so I can't find it. Okay, hold up. I'm going to go right now. Why it's not available no more salty. So what else? Hey, no, not for nothing. So check this out. I'm gonna show you how cool it is, Franco. Everybody who wanna laugh at me, literally, watch this. I'm on just I'm watching Justin stream right now, right? Why? Because I've been using it. I got it built into a tripod. So it's been sitting in front of me the whole time. And I was even using it earlier no. when I was when I was streaming. It, I, it does that too. 
Yeah, look, watch it, right? So it's a tripod. You could bend it and make you can make it to a selfie stick. So I could you could make you could bend it, put it around your neck. Oh, damn, it's, damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure you find that thing for me. It's official. Yeah, it's that official. is pretty dope. It's dope. But, That's the fanciest coat hanger I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> well, not for nothing. It could be a coat hanger. Yeah, I guess. And now the truth say that, I probably could make one. But nah, it, it comes in handy. I mean, the coat hanger scratch your neck up, but. Hell yeah, coat hanger fuck you up. Yeah, literally. I had this thing sitting here in front of me, like. Like uh, yes, when I was at uh, Sandy's mom's house, right? Me and me and Bobby was playing games on my phone. I literally turned into a tripod and sat it on a table. Me and him was sitting on the bed with a controller playing on my phone, and it was just sitting there perfectly. Hold on a second, Ant. Mike. What the fuck you looking at? <laughs> <laughs> hey man, you know baby shower season is about to start up. Oh, oh he ain't planning one. He ain't, go, he ain't going to one it with this current. He, he uh, better outbreak. not. Oh, Mike gonna make sure he one of the ten people. Andy, what are you but again, you gotta that? you gotta remember how many people been cooped up in the house with nothing else to do. It's called staying alive. Exactly. This is true, but it's also gonna lead to another baby boom. Not me. Listen, man. Not me. I, I like I like that running joke. Everybody's like, oh, watch it be all these these, these um. Quarantine, oh, baby. baby. Listen, if you being on quarantine leads to another baby boom, bro. You was gonna make that baby regardless. That shit don't make no difference. It really don't make no difference. Don't nobody sit in the house like, oh man, oh man, I'm sitting in this house. I've been stuck in this house for a week. I guess I'll just go get some pussy. <laughs> no, if it's there, you gonna be getting it regardless. You Franco, remember? It. Hey, Franco, remember when we was younger? When we, <laughs> when we was to the young everybody. people that I was living with. We called it in house. So you yes. already had it in house. And you know, not even that's true. It's not gonna make a difference. If anything, the baby rate should go down because everybody's quarantined. <laughs> everybody's quarantined. <laughs> Everybody got on some whole shit like, oh man, the quarantine. Let me go find some random person to go lay up under for the next couple months. <laughs> Which I'm not against. If that's what they want to do, I, I'm cool with that. <laughs> but I'm just saying. So what else do I want to discuss? Eugene. Yo. What the fuck you doing? He's, no, play, he's, he's probably playing Streets of Rage. You cannot multitask, can you? No. Nah. No, he doesn't. No. <laughs> hey, cleavage. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What the hell happened? I'm always interested to see boobies first. I can't. All you saw was, you saw was cleavage when you were sitting down. That's just, just like... Kitties. It's like, look, there it is, like cleavage. <laughs> and this is what you came to see. <laughs> Straight we up. just talked about my personalities and my tits are what pe bring people to Twitch. Let's go. There you go. <laughs> I found my niche. Your niche. Yes. You found your niche. Tits and Twitch. Tits and Twitch for the bit. So let's go. Damn. And talking about See, giving blowjobs on the Pants Off podcast. Oh, here's a good thing. Dang, so this is the right there. So, I so talk, why the fuck about every podcast? What do you mean you missed it? You you know how you know how uh, my girl make homemade pickles sometimes. What? You're banned from it. Why? Because she said you never gave her her jar back, and she will not I, give you any more pick leaves. I tried to give the jar back. She will not give you any more. I tried to give the jar back numerous times. You live next door. You ain't trying that hard. You ain't tried that hard, Man, bro. Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me. Hold on a second. Let's just turn around the screen. But there we go. Now let me turn this screen around for a second. Get him. If the shit works. I, I don't know. The shit won't work. <laughs> I saw trees for a second. What was you trying to do? 
Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Oh, you know what I do? I gotta go to my full screen. All right, so here's me sitting on the porch. This is my dogs. This is right. <laughs> this is my porch. That is Eugene's porch right there. <laughs> right there. It's about to be, it's about to be streamception, y'all. It's about to be streamception, y'all. Literally, literally is it, a five foot walk. It's terrible how you have to build Eugene the in the doing shit. He can't return a jar. That will get him piglies. <laughs> he ran away. <laughs> no, I think he went to the porch. I think he went to the porch. He's probably about to run down the steps with the oh, jar. Oh, yeah, he got <laughs> up. He got up. It's about to be streamception. Watch. He going to get that jar right now. Because she legit has not made any more. No, she actually made it twice since then. But both times, she's like, I will send Eugene something, but he will never get my, he ain't never getting my jar back. For, uh, and now she is officially saying she ain't sending him no more. For those that uh, are ignorant to what those are, what is that exactly? What, Pickley's? Yes. So Pickley's is basically their answer to, like, hot sauce when you put it on food and stuff. So they make this type of pork called Grio, right? And it's, um, and you know what? It's an island thing, so maybe mm -hmm. it's called something different in Jamaica. But mm -hmm. it's basically they get a pork shoulder, right? And um, they chop it up into cubes and then kind of like fry it down hard. Mm -hmm. And um, it's kind of dry, but it tastes it's dry on the outside, but it's juicy on the inside. And it tastes really good. But pickles, from what I learned, that is what I always ate it with. It looks like coleslaw. It's legitimately coleslaw, basically. But they put like some types of peppers in it. And you sit it and let it sit in the juices and it gets spicy. And you use that instead of hot sauce. You literally put it on your, your pork. And I eat it in my John John, which is the black rice that they make. Yo. <laughs> did he just put the, did put he the camera it? on him? Put the camera on him, Franco. <laughs> I am that petty. <laughs> <laughs> Return to the jar. <laughs> so that's all it takes. Thread, thread it no more. You got to guilt him into no doing shit. You know that. I, I thought I'd get that jar back. No, 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 no. I love the fact that as he's doing it, he admits he's that petty. Yeah, I am that petty. He, did. he said, I'm Yo, that petty. You, you realize he had to look for it, though, right? Because you saw him. You yeah, saw him leave right. the room. He then he was like, then he came back like, oh, shit. It was in the fifth grade. He had to wash it out, he said. <laughs> but he brought it back. I'm about him, my bedroom slippers and shit. Look, look, look. So this Better jar right here had the, had the pig leaves in it, right? And you just sprinkle it across. I eat it, I eat it on the John John rice. I eat it with the chicken. Yeah, I, that's what I was saying. I eat it with the rice. I eat mm -hmm. it with the chicken. Eat it with the pork. You can literally eat it with anything that you like spicy. Right. Um, and it has a good flavor to it too. That's what's so up. really good um alternative to hot sauce. I think. I actually used to try to eat it straight, but that shit get hot. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that's why she ain't making hot. Well, I told this right. I accept the challenge. But it's a hot. <laughs> but Eugene does like hot stuff, so. I know he like hot stuff, but uh -huh. just like he said, she petty, so. If he, if I go at her, yo, I'm gonna go at her like super petty and be like, yo, Eugene said, pickle your jar. He said, the reason why it took so long to give it back, because you lied, the pickles wasn't hot enough. And, and next time, <laughs> you know, she, that's gonna go one of two ways. She's gonna cuss Eugene right. out the next time. She'll give him some, or she gonna make the hottest fucking version she possibly can. I'm gonna tell her too. Call right here right now. I'm gonna tell her oh, too. Eugene ain't gonna really be blowing shit up from the bathroom now with that shit talking about he was earlier. He do that already, so you know. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, just mix up the combination of well, peppers with the jalapeno and the Oaxacas and the Chipotle's. Well, Mike can drink water. <laughs> hey, I've been making myself drink more water lately. I'm very proud of myself. You know what helped me drink more water? Um, seltzer water. Because I'm obsessed with Pepsi, I drank soda nonstop. And then the other day, like like a week ago, I bought a bottle of seltzer water because by accident, I think I hit the button by accident. I was like, well, like I spent my money, I'm, I'm gonna drink it. Bubbly. And now I'm drinking seltzer water. 
and I noticed I'm drinking less soda. I just needed a big so, cup, and I can keep it well cold, and I'm good. You want food? I'm sorry, Melly. I don't have no food for you. Huh? You got chicken soup for the soul. Yeah, I ain't doing nothing else. I'm out here enjoying the well, I'm, about, I'm about ready to play some Streets of Rage for myself. Listen, forget. Listen, listen. They need to patch in four players online. I they really do, man. To do me a favor because I'm about to buy a little super hot peppers and tell her I dare you to make it with this. I bet you she will. All right, tell me how many she made. Word up. I'm going to tell her. Why would you? As soon as I go in there, when we've done this call, I go in there, I'm like, yo, Eugene said, Pick with a jar. He's sorry it took so long to get back, but he wanted to know if you can make when you make it again. If you can make him some super hot one, he'll buy you the peppers. Tell him what, how many you need. I need. Why? Why is sushi gonna make you annoy a drone? First of all, Kelly. I I was talking to somebody in chat, but I need everybody to get freaking Brawlhalla on their PS4 so we can get all. Play. I had Brawlhalla. I just never played. Same. You need to play it. Listen, are you in here for it? But next weekend is my stream anniversary, so I'm gonna do a long ass fucking stream all weekend and as long as I possibly can. So I want to do like Hala? a raw holla would be one of the things I want to do, and I want to play raw holla with you guys because I'm, I'm terrible that. at it and it's still hold, but it's fun to play. Just get us all in a fucking Discord call like this, playing for some raw holla and having fun because I can play it on my P uh, the PC and it's cross platform with PS4. Well, my thing is, I only play, I download these games and never play them unless I play with other people. So, well, if you oh, play, if you tell me play, I will play. We have it. Bam, I'm down. I'm with it. I'll make the room. It's easier if I make the room to do it and then I just drop the room number in like our chat and then everybody can just join the room because then um, I'll hide it so nobody else can join us. Do you, suggestion, we don't have to do it this way, but su suggestion, do y'all want to make that part of. The Mighty J podcast next Sunday. We just play Brawlhalla with Kim next Sunday. Nah. You... Nah. Okay. <laughs> if you could figure, so look at her face. how would you? No, how would I'm you trying stream? to think. Like I'm starting the stream Saturday at like four or five, right? So it'll already Wait, be you're twenty. You trying to make like a nonstop stream? Okay. This is this is what I Brawlhalla is interesting. So a stream anniversary, I'm trying to do what's called a subathon slash streamathon, which means it's based on how much support I get while I'm on, how long I stay on. So a sub will make me stay streaming for like 30 minutes more. Five dollar donation will make me stream for 30 minutes more, all the way up to whenever, like as far as I can go. No cares. So, 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 I donated a thousand. so does that mean you're stopping up on Red Bulls now? I don't drink. If I donated. Anything. If I donated a thousand dollars, would you stream for twenty four hours straight? Hell yes, I would. <laughs> and I'd even send you like a private twerk video for a G. Let's go. I don't, I don't, I'm a seller. I, I, I don't. I don't have a thousand dollars. I got two small kids. I know. I, I don't, adorable. I don't <laughs> Cam, Cam, you want me to send you some of this unemployment money? Yeah, I'm unemployed, <laughs> but I don't get no six hundred dollars a week. Is my phone again? again? You know, it's weird. I don't even know if, like, that's what they said, but I have yet to just get only $600. It's, it's, it it comes in so it's, random. It's, it's weird. I was looking into it. It's, like, weird how that's set up. Um, they, I think they it just, has to do with your job, and your job may have to, like, fill out something. Or, no, no, but what I'm saying right. is, I have, I have yet, like, they always send me just random amounts of money. I... I can't like, and nothing has ever been I just six hundred dollars. But it's always it's more than six hundred dollars, right? It's, to be, it's not supposed to be just six hundred dollars. It's supposed to be whatever your unemployment is, and but, an additional six hundred. No, no, no. But, but so I actually talked to unemployment. So they said what it is is they're gonna give you a regular unemployment, and then on the off week they send you that. Uh, because remember it's uh you you file for biweekly for um right. one week and the next week. So they on the off week they're gonna send you that six hundred dollars. So it's well, like you, weird. Well, you, you you can claim every week also. Right. Yeah. Well, when you, you so here's how I do it. You wait two weeks. Again, I'm doing it in Pennsylvania. So I'm doing it in Pennsylvania. But you wait two weeks and you claim two weeks. Every you wait two weeks and claim two weeks. But it's right. weird. I don't know. I don't get it. Just say, just say, Aunt, you don't give a shit. I mean. You don't give a shit. As long as I'm Same. getting paid and I'm not losing that money, then I'm cooking. Green cleaning still. If I'm lose, then I'll start. When I start losing money, then I'll be like, whoa, 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 whoa. 
But yeah, it's on now. The reality of it is like trying to find another job and when should I start looking for another job? That's the question. You know? Well, what you you can't so you're, the you're, job you have right, is it going to exist once all this is over? Your job yeah, no. They when they let us go, they called us into a room. It, the dirty part, they called me into a room with six people. It was six of us. And they said all at the same time? No, no, no. Listen, this is what's crazy. They called they was they was doing small meetings. They called in six mm-hmm. of us and said unfortunately because of coronavirus and the workforce is uh, you know, uh workforce is low, we got to let some of you guys go. And they let go three of us and kept three of us. I'm like, why do you even keep us in the same room with three? Now I'm looking at three people like, wow, y'all yeah, stayed. And, I mean, what I was now, now, now I'm looking at three island. people. I want to kick in the chest. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, I get it. I was new. So at the end of the day, I, I you know, I was there for what, like a, almost two months. So I get it. But I feel like the other people that was in the room, I was there for a while. That's kind of messed up to them. Like, they you, they, 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 they should have just called some people going and send me a fucking email. Like, bitch, don't come back tomorrow. I'm like, all right, cool. Yeah, they should have. I feel like, well, they had to hand us, they handed us, like, paperwork, um, like, for unemployment and all that stuff. But I feel like they should have just had, like, six people that was getting let go in the same room. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's, they was like just send us, send us three that are staying, three that are going. Right. Like, so anyway, but, um, but yeah, so long story short, I said to Lady, I said, well, usually when I hear the term unemployed, that means at some point we're coming back. I was like, so she was like, no. She was like, you know, um, I was like, should I be looking for another job? She's like, yeah, we recommend you do. We can't say that we can't bring you guys back so that you're actually, you know, this is the, you know, you're, you're no longer going to be here. I was like, damn. But my brother, Fuck you. but the Fuck guy, you. The, 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 the CEO liked me a lot. My brother said, uh, CEO did reach out to him and say, listen, tell your brother when things get better, we'll bring him back. But how long is that going to be? And can't, he's saying that he said it's December, then, but December 32nd. My thing is, but can he hold up to it, you know? And then again, the flip side, my brother was the one that said that to me. So all I know, he could have just made that up to make me feel be- feel good. You know your brother doesn't know you did too. Yeah. Oh, we, yeah, so. Always has been, always will be. And that's what we love about him. Yep. He ain't doing nothing out of character. Unfortunately, yes, this is true. <laughs> yeah. When he used to break my toys and blame it on Franco? Oh shit! Unless it really was Franco, or or do some ill shit and then tell Eric that we did it. Yep. You see Eric chasing me around with a flip flop. Maybe we used to try to fuck him up, and he like. Eric, Eric. <laughs> that was like the the danger call. We knew we was in fucking trouble. And when he started crying, oh my god, oh my god. Yo, like, Anthony's grandfather was legit the only adult I was afraid of other than my mom, my grandma, and my aunt. Yeah, man. Yo, he was jacked for an old dude. dude. Yo, not not just that, but he legit was like, I almost think, did my mom ever had a conversation with him, like, just whoop my ass? <laughs> probably. Uh, probably. <laughs> oh, shit. Because I think that. one time we did, we did some dumb shit, and then my mom was like, next time just whoop his ass. Like, something like that, and I was Damn. shocked. <laughs> yeah, and he used to pull up, he used to pull off the, that thick flip that flop. Flip flop? Yo. But you can't tell me nothing. Eric was a great dude. I loved him. Yeah, man. Yeah, I met him a couple of times back in the day. Yeah. Mean as a cuss. But he was a good dude. Yeah, yeah, he was a good dude, man. But uh he wanted to protect Craig at all costs. All costs. All costs. I'm like, yo. Craig was his baby. Yes. For real. Uh, You know what it is, though? I think, I feel like Craig looked like Eric. To me, I feel like he looked like Eric. I always thought that. Him and Erica looked like Eric. Yeah, man. That's the. Yeah, so crazy. So I named my son Eric, you know? His middle name is Eric. Yeah. Are you getting in trouble? Or anything? No, that's uh, you know, unfortunately. So I used to stream in the living room, then I moved to my bedroom because I wanted to be quieter. But then the door just opens, and it's the two girls, and 
Yeah, I'm telling you. And whenever and whenever I say to my wife, I'm taking that, getting moving the pool table and make that to a game room so I can have quiet. You can't do that. But then I got to deal with this stuff. <laughs> What happened to your ass? That's what I got mad for. I'm the man of this house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Get real quick, don't it? She almost <laughs> fucked me up the other day. Uh, Anthony? Huh? Sandy almost fucked you up the other day. Oh, say that again? I said Sandy almost fucked you up the other day. Oh. Now, you know what's funny? That's, um, <laughs> here's what's funny. That's that's all. That now that video, you know, it's funny. That video is like three years old. But I was just like, <laughs> let me put an old video up. Let yeah. me hear about this. Oh yes. What happened? So what happened? So what happened was I was playing a prank. So I had Sierra, Sandy's daughter, sitting on the couch, right? So all you see, I'm gonna put the video, let you guys see the video. But all you see is my sure, daughter yeah. was sitting on the table eating, right? And I threw a flip flop. How funny enough is a flip flop? I hit her in the ribs. So she starts screaming, ah! ah. So then. I take a, a a plastic uh a bottle, a soda bottle, and throw it, and it went past her and hit over a drink, and it fell on Sandy's phone. So she was like, "Oh, <laughs> you got the drink all over Sandy's phone!" First of all, she's snitching, and two, you see Sandy like, and mind you, I'm recording it all. I didn't know that was gonna happen, so I got it all on tape, like authentic. And she's like, "Yo, man, look at my phone!" And this year is just gonna turn the camera and catch her all pissed off. Yo, she was hot, whole, yo. And the funny thing is, Sandy has no clue she's being recorded. So, and I'm Dude, trying not so to laugh, funny. huh? She's so focused on her anger on you. <laughs> yes. And I'm trying, hey, Franco, listen, I'm trying not to laugh, and I turn and look at the camera, and she has no clue, as I'm still laughing. She's like, look what you did on my phone. I'm like, I'm like, well, technically it wasn't me. It was the juice that was on the table. She's like, what? <laughs> oh, man. Hilarious. Yeah, oh. I, you almost got these hands that day, huh? Yeah, yeah man. for real. She was hot. He was by the dead time. Uh, all right, good, man, time, so, good time, good so, time. So, we need to link up once all this bullshit is over with. Yeah, for real, man. And you like, know, who, you, and you know where we linking up at, right? Where? John B. Washington. <laughs> <laughs> he's making pizza. I don't have yep. my slice. He doesn't know he's making pizza, but he's making pizza. Oh, he's making pizza. Or brisket. Yeah. Or hey, brisket. Uh, you know what? Cool? I think one of the coolest I'm things sorry. I've seen was when True and Franco got yes. to link up. That was all. Awesome. Right. One second. It was too too, man. That was really cool, though, man. I'm, I'm Just curious. to see a picture of you two together. together. Let me ask, hey, day fellas. Day hey, y'all, let me ask y'all a question. Yo. Who here likes sauerkraut? Ooh, yes. On what? Sure, I'm a All right, show of hands. We got a decent amount of people like sauerkraut. I'm Mary sauerkraut. picked I'm this up the other day. What is, what is that? It is sauerkraut. It's basically squeeze bottle sauerkraut. Oh, man, you don't put that on some hot dogs, boy? <laughs> Shit. Of course, UG's like Mike. He's in everything. I was like, ew. Because the first thing I thought was like, chewed up sauerkraut. Like, I don't need my sauerkraut chewed up for me. Like, that shit's weird as hell. <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you right now, I love sauerkraut. I will not eat that shit. <laughs> and here's my reason why. I also like onions, right? Right. So right. at any given time, I'll make a hot dog with the works, which would be ketchup, mustard, preferably spicy mustard, sauerkraut, relish, onions. You know what I mean? And if I really want to be a fat bastard, I'll throw some some cheese and and, and chili on it, too. I, I had right. one. Hell it yeah. might be right back to me. It didn't go up. It's so, fine. This one time I went Damn, I just to sent you the thing. and they had everything except they didn't have chopped up onions. They had packs of onions, like ketchup packs of onions. Ew. Oh, my hell dumb no. Ass, Danny, we watch yeah, my dumb ass was like, oh, it's probably still good. It's an onion. It's got to taste like an onion. I squeezed the shit on my hot dog. I bit it and I almost died. Is that Josie? Like, I'm pretty sure I died inside and then resurrected <laughs> because it had to be yeah, no, the I'm nastiest good. feeling. Let, let me get my crowd out of the jar so I can put it on my roof. Like, that shit was horrible. Now, do I like sauerkraut? Yes, I do. Will I eat sauerkraut that you can squeeze out of a mustard bottle? Fuck to the I mean, no. <laughs> 
Now, I need to be able to get that out of a jar. Yeah, as soon as I saw that shit, I was like, ew. Have you tried it yet? I'm gonna try it tonight. I'm gonna try it tonight, and I'm gonna text you because I want to know. I'm curious. But gee, when I saw my immediate response was like, "Yo, no." He's like, "I gotta know." <laughs> all, all he's gonna do is send you a message saying, "Franco, it tastes like regret. It tastes <laughs> like regret." <laughs> Franco, I put the uh, I put the video in the, uh, our chat, and I sent it to you, uh, Kim. I it's real short. It. It's like a minute long. Yeah, I'm not in y'all's chat. I'm not special. I know. So. That's why. I, oh, well. Because our chat has a lot. You, you probably don't want to see some of the stuff that we send right. in that. Uh, no. You're talking about Kim. You're, you're, you're talking Kim. about me. Definitely <laughs> <laughs> are talking about Kim. <laughs> what, wait, wait, wait. Give me one example of one of the things you don't want. You think okay. I don't want to see. Okay. I'm oh, talking about all the new pictures and I'm sex videos about, of you. Of me? Okay. I, I was there for him, so why would I, I, I want to see him? I made that up. I'm just kidding. I'm talking if about the ceiling, but that I don't you want care. To, if you want to donate some of these things to the chat, you're more than welcome. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I, trauma, I almost traumatized Franco and Anthony with that one. <laughs> hey, Dub, I'm looking at the thumbnail, right? She looked just my thumbnail. No, mm -mm. Huh? Oh, you talking about the one that, that one I put in there? No, there's nothing you guys can say. Kim, now, I'll say something's Kim gross. Kim will like but... that one. Kim will like that one. The one that almost every last one of y'all, when I when y'all saw that, it messaged me or commented like, what the fuck is that? And I was like, look closer. <laughs> okay, Rafiki. Kim, I'm surprised you didn't see it on my Facebook because I made it as a Facebook post. Oh, really? What do you know in yeah. Sono? What's wrong? Huh? Yes, I know my boobs hit the camera. Okay, I can't help that. <laughs> Listen, it's either you get a face full of titty or you get a face full of booty cheek. And I can't show booty cheek on Twitch. Because I wear booty shorts here. here. It's hot as fuck by this computer. It's 100 degrees here today, y'all. 100. Yeah, I can't 80, turn my fan on because right it's too net because it's too loud. Yeah, it's pretty warm here today, too. So instead of showing booty cheek, you get a nice view of the cleavage and everybody's happy. It's funny. <laughs> Indeed. You wasn't ready? I'm sorry you weren't ready. It's funny because yeah, Larry's in Texas. Yes. But Ant looks like he should be in Texas. No. Yeah, right? Listen, she it's was talking about gimmicks. Whenever I do my game streaming, I wear a cowboy hat, and I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to wear it whenever I stream. That's you know? why his command in my chat is exclamation point cowboy. Yeah, and I was really about to put that, that cowboy sound to it. <laughs> Actually, cause yeah, I could I could record that for you and send it off to her. She could set that shit up. Your whole, I'm a cowboy. Yeah, cause when I was doing my stream, oh, I, I had it, I had it where you uh, you, I had it where the camera would make you disappear if you get out of focus. So I would always start off and do that, and they go, oh man. And when I would back up my chair, I would just disappear in the darkness. But that was my thing. Eugene, I know, I know, I know. Eugene, what's your problem, man? You know, what sucks is that, is that she thing? gets stuck in my fucking head. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Eugene had that ringtone taking me, right? Huh? Eugene just made that ringtone after he heard it on my phone one time. Probably. So I think I was playing it or some shit. Is that Ike? What up, Ike? Hey, Ike! Who's <laughs> that? I was a boy to Ed, let me know my daughter wasn't in school today. Hey. Yeah, I, like I, I just got the same call. That is so retarded that y'all still get that call. I, I, I need to I need to get on my kids for not being in school. Bad kid, go back to school. Yes. I think the boy to Ed don't know they're not in school right now, right? The murder, murder, murder. I love how Mikey is the one that has random guest stars just popping up in the back of it. Like, Hell yeah, Dunn was in the chat. Dunn was in here the other day. And then it was now it's Ike. Mike, the only person I know about who was star PlayStation party, right? But no Mike on. Yeah, last week last week was done. We just oh, really? Yeah. I think yeah. next week we you. <laughs> Uh, what else y'all want to discuss? Anything else, guys? I'm thinking about trying to cut my grass before the the sun go down. Well, no, we been, you know what? Um, we've been here for two hours. This will literally, be, if we stop now, this will literally be our shortest stream. <laughs> 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 
still fun. But uh, yeah, I got Mary telling me dinner's almost ready. Oh and, uh, boy. I will definitely. I'm over. I'm gonna send this to Anthony Franco and Eugene to do what they like with the feed. And... Can, you service, Jeffrey? can you cut down? Can you shrimp it down though before you send it? No, I'm gonna send you the raw footage. You edit oh. it yourself. Yeah, you gotta do that on your own. Do I ask him to cut it down for me? So is, is that what I'm supposed to be scared of, Mikey? Because I'll critique this. Just, just finish. Just finish it. I, I can't do it now because oh. I got the mic on. And, but and I would Eugene, definitely... what part would you like him to cut down? Like he's supposed to know what you want. Yeah. Oh. Since all the nonsense talk we did before we actually start. That's, well, see, that's the easiest so that's a... edit to do. It Eddie, you can do that shit on your exactly. phone. Hey, Gene, exactly. I can send you a couple of different apps that could do that if you like. Yeah, hey, I'm you. not an I'm just too lazy to do the shit. No, it's a, it's. Yeah, I got to the volume. There's the key point. He just don't want to edit it. He just like yep. you said. He's too lazy to do the shit. Yeah, I got, I got, I got Sony Vegas. And I hate fucking using that damn thing. Don't use Sony Vegas, dude. I use Power Director on my phone. It's a fucking free app in the Android store. Dude, I use Elgato. I use Kind Master, but then it's another thing called UClip. If you use use Clip, is oh, super God. simple. I died while picking up my, my picking my food up. Yeah, huh? he ain't paying no fucking mind. Oh, he ain't even paying attention. So I know they're trying to pick up his cheeseburger. It's I actually just, ramen noodles. Anthony, oh, I just I'm changed sorry. mine to uh, pizza and ham. Anthony, where can the people find you at, dog? Guys, you can oh. find me since you guys brought up Twitch last time. I left out my Twitch, but I do have a Twitch. It's All Purpose Champion Crew. You can find me mostly on. And now your mama knows on YouTube, and you can find me on Facebook at Anthony L. Lewis, and you can find me on IG at, and now your mama knows, or it's now your mama knows everything, and on and, and on uh, uh, Twitter, twi what's the other one called that Donald Trump uses all the time? Twitter. 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 <laughs> oh, Twitter. There you go. You can find me, <laughs> and now your mama knows on Twitter as well. All right, I'll, I'll just do this for you, Gene. You can find him on Black Dragon Seven Nine on YouTube and pretty much anywhere else. Yeah, basically. Well, IG is ebigum79 on, on Instagram. All right. You can find me on pretty much everything at DJ Justin Love. JustinLoveEntertainment.com. Kim, where can we find you at? At Nerdish Girl on Twitch uh, <laughs> and Facebook. I'm Nerdish Grill on Instagram. And I'm working on everything else. All right, Nitty Mac, where can we find you at? You find me on Instagram at Nitty Mac and on Facebook at Franco Coaches Roberts. <laughs> I ain't got shit up. I love that, I man. Actually, I, did. I, <laughs> I started, I'm working <laughs> on starting to twist, um, but I'm trying to figure out what it's going to be called right now. It's the Nitty Mac, but ain't shit on there. Um, and yeah, that's about it. Oh, Twitter, Nitty Mac. That's me. Twitter, Nitty Mac. Mike, where can we find you at? You can find me on Twitter, yeah, YouTube, Twitch, IG, Facebook, Marvel Wonders, and on Facebook as Michael Trammell, and on Snapchat at iMarvelWonders. Snapchat? And if you ask him hard enough, he'll give Snapchat. you his government. Oh, shit. Where <laughs> <laughs> right. can we find through. you at? <sighs> Hey, True. Oh, yo, you can just find me on Twitch at TrueCSW. I'm still setting everything up. I'll let y'all know the details later. I'll be on Twitch Friday and Saturday, usually from 5 Eastern till 8. Same on Saturday. All right, bet. We're... All right, gentlemen and Kim, as always, I want to thank you guys for hey, being here. Michelle, sorry, right? this, has been the My <laughs> this has been the Mighty Jade Empire Podcast. Thanks for being here. Nacho, thank you again for being down and for the biddies. Guys, y'all take care. I will see y'all again next Sunday, and I will link up with you way sooner than later. I love you guys. All right. Peace. Later. Peace.